fire from heaven. David became a great king. Then his son Solomon reigned. After Solomon died, God's people had many bad kings. King Ahab was one of the worst. His wife, Jezebel, worshipped the false god Baal. persuaded Ahab and God's people to worship Baal too. Because of their sins, God stopped the rain for several years. Then he sent his prophet Elijah to King Ahab. disobeyed God and worshipped Baal, Elijah said. Tell everyone, including the prophets of Baal, to meet me on Mount Carmel. I will prove who the true God is. Everyone gathered on the mountain. Then Elijah said to the people, Make up your mind. If the Lord is God, follow him. However, if Baal proves himself today, follow him. Baal's prophets and I will each kill a bull, place it on an altar, and pray. The God that sends fire to burn up the bull is the true God. Daniel, 
and he became a powerful leader in that country. Some leaders were jealous of Daniel, so they made a new law. People could only pray to King Darius. Whoever disobeyed would be thrown into a lion's den. Darius agreed. Daniel still prayed to God and was arrested. Darius was sad. He liked Daniel. He realized he'd been tricked but couldn't change the law. Daniel was thrown to the lions. God who sent him. The angel shut the lion's mouths. Daniel spent the night there unharmed. <laughs> At daybreak, Darius went to see if Daniel was alive. God sent an angel to save me, Daniel said. The king was thrilled. Daniel was pulled out of the den. Then King Darius had Daniel's enemies thrown into the den. The lions gobbled them up. King Darius told everyone in his kingdom to honor Daniel's powerful living God. Oh. <laughs> 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 